Talk to You, where music is easy and fun to learn. I'm Jay Crowell, and today I'm going to teach Ethiopia by the Red Hot Chili Peppers. So this groove is in what's called 7-4 time, which means there's seven quarter notes in the measure instead of four. So you can think about it to make it easier as two measures, a measure of four and a measure of three. Like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. That'll make it a little easier instead of thinking about it in seven. So for the first measure, the measure of four, pretty straight ahead, bass on one and three, snare on two and four. That's all it is. And then for the three measure, you're going to have bass drum on one and snare drum on the and of two and then open hi-hat on three. One and two. So that's just the bass track of it before we add some ghost notes in. So I'm just going to play that real quick. You're gonna add a buzz roll right before, on, like, technically if you're thinking about it in measure of four, measure of three, you're gonna add a buzz roll on the and of four leading into the three measure with one, your left hand, so a ghost note, just like that. Kind of like a little lead in fill. Now, because it's a Chili Peppers tune, what you wanna do, you wanna watch out for your left foot. Because what Chad Smith likes to do is he likes to bounce his foot up and down which is what most drummers do, but typically when you bounce your foot, the hi-hat's gonna stay closed. So you like to kinda open the hi-hat. Kinda gets that weird, sloppy, slappy sound to it. So you wanna add that, try to add that to it. All you need to do is just bounce your foot on the eighth notes. One, and two, and three, and four, and four. Thank you for joining us here at Rock U. Again, I'm Jake Crowell. See you next time.